Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's a girl city. On my last video, we have tackled some chunky sneakers option that we can find from Shopee to really try the chunky sneaker or dad sneaker trend. And if you haven't seen it, I'll be linking it up here. But in today's episode of Balling on a Budget, I have looked for cute, trendy, IG cool girl bag options. Retro bags are back, you guys, and I'm really, really here for it. If you're someone that follows a lot of influencers or a lot of fashionistas, you know that these bags that I will be showing you are really trendy. This baguette or hobo bags. I've been seeing them a lot and I'm really, really excited to like try these trends because growing up, I used to think that they're ugly, <laughs> but now that they're coming back, I've become more appreciative of the vintage look that they give. I made sure to check on Shopee and save you guys from burning some cash because not everyone has that cash to burn for an expensive Prada hobo bag or any expensive cheese for that matter. So if you guys are interested to see everything that I got, then let's head into the video. Here's the first trendy bag that I purchased. As you can see, this is really reminiscent of that Prada nylon hobo bag. I think the original version of the Prada bag is around 30 to 60,000. I'm not too sure about it because I didn't really bother to check it out because I know I wouldn't be buying it. But in Shopee, I got this one for 235 pesos. I originally wanted to get the black version of this. Pero wala silang stock because maraming ang bumibili nito because it's trendy. But it's okay, I chose this baby pink one. And you know what? I think it's it's great to add or spice up my outfit because most of the time I would be wearing just black and white. So this one is a really good addition and also I really love pink. In person, it's really really cute. Um, it has no structure on the strap though. It's more of parang yung nylon lang talaga or yung parang pinaka fabric ng bag yung structure niya. So medyo parang flimsy siya tingnan sa camera as you can see. Inside, nandito pa yung parang balloon that they use to uh, make sure na hindi siya malulukot masyado. In all fairness to this bag though, the inside is very spacious. So I think I can store a lot of things pag gagamitin ko na siya like my phone, my wallet, lipstick, and also my glasses. There's also one small compartment inside. Ayan, meron siyang zipper dito. Hindi nyo siguro makita kasi black din siya. But here it is. Ang thing din pala dito, mas maikli siya than the Prada Hobo Bag the original. I think yung Prada na original, mas mahaba yung strap. This one, very shoulder bag talaga siya. Like, maikli lang. I'll show you a try-on clip. But all in all, for 235 pesos, it's not really bad. And it's something na trendy lang naman. Okay, next bag on our list is something that you might have seen at least once or twice on Instagram. I think every influencer or vlogger na pinapollow ko meron nito or nagpost na about this. But here you go. This is the retro alligator or croc skin na handbag. I got it in white. At first glance, ang ganda niya talaga. And also, the strap. I think the strap length on this one, I like more than the Prada Hobo Bag look. Kasi mas mahaba siya. And it gives room para sa kilikili ko. Kasi guys, pawisin ako. So, I don't want anything na, ano mo yun, nagtatouch masyado sa kilikili ko. So, this one is just perfect. Gusto ko din na yung zipper goes all the way here. Or nagbubukas siya until dito. Kasi, I don't know, kita mo agad ko ano yung kukunin mo. Inside, meron siyang compartment here. And then, meron namang zipper dito. Ayan. So, may paglalagyan ka din ng barya or ng pera mo kapag kailangan mo or ayaw mo mong dala ng wallet. Although, it's really pretty. If I'm gonna be nitpicky on this one, I would say na yung quality niya or yung construction niya is not really the best because ang daming mga loose strings here. Tapos, meron din dito. Ayan. And when you open the inside, meron dito yung mga loose strings. And meron din mga parts where I see na hindi ganun ka seamless yung pagkakagawa. But for the price na 315 pesos, I think you'll get what you're paying for. Siguro ang ma-advise ko lang is not to put something na very heavy dito. Casual lang siya talaga ng mga gala. Ayun. So, pag mag-mall ka lang or 
So if you're gonna be running errands, na hindi mo kailangan magdala ng masyadong gamit, then this is the bag for you. And if I'm gonna be rating this, I would give this four stars because yung inexpect ko naman na itsura niya is ganun talaga yung itsura niya. It's just the quality. I'm not very sure about it. Third bag that I will be showing you is similar to this one except that the fabric or the material that they used is corduroy. So here it is. I love everything that I got but I'm gonna be biased and say that this one is my favorite because I like the aesthetic of it. Parang very classy, retro chic. It gives me that 90s or 80s look that I need kapag ang gusto ko yung major retro looking yung suot ko. So, I really really like this. I like the detail here. Yung flap niya, ayan siya. So, meron siyang uh, magnetic closure dito. Tapos, corduroy yung material and it's really really soft. I would say the construction of it, maganda siya ha for the price na 325 pesos. Seamless naman siya. Though, meron, meron parang loose string dito. Ayan o. Oh. So, meron dito loose string. But for the most part, okay na okay siya. This one also has that nice strap length that I'm looking for. So, hindi siya ganun kadikit sa kilikili. It just gives me room to move. I also like the contrast of the camel or the tan color against the black strap. Super fashion talaga nitong bag na to. That's why it's my favorite. I would give this one a 6 out of 5 stars if that's possible. Kasi ang ganda niya talaga ha. Hindi ko yun expect masyado na ganito yung itsura niya. Ngayon ko lang dito yung fabric na ginamit nila inside. Parang classic -y. So kapag may kinakapa ka sa loob, tumutunog siya. So ayan, papayan ko sa inyo. So medyo ASMR Guys. If you're wanting to try this trend, then I highly recommend this bag. Super love ko siya and sulit siya guys. As in, sulit talaga. Last two bags that I will be showing you is actually similar. Magkaiba lang sila ng kulay. Kasi it's so cute that I had to get it in two different colors. The bags that I'm talking about are these two bags right here. So I got the black one and also the pink one. And before I tell you how much I got them for, pulaan yung muna guys. I'll give you 5 seconds to guess kung magkano ko sila nabili each. These are jelly sling bags. Yung design nila is parang quilted Chanel yung dating. Would you believe that I got them for 130 pesos each? 130 pesos. Medyo na ako nung dumating sila. Kasi, for 130 pesos, I'm not really expecting anything from this. Ang gusto ko lang sana dumating sila in good condition. Pero pagdating nila, I mean, they're so freaking cute that this one I had to wear sa isa naming event sa office. It matched perfectly with the dress that I was wearing that day. And yung hardwares niya are both in gold. So, very classic or very classy chic vibe yung binibigay niya. And the best thing that I like about these bags, I can wear them in two ways. Pwede ko silang gamitin ng pag or parang shoulder bag. Tapos, pag hinila ko yung strap na to, it becomes a sling bag. It's small, it's compact, but inside meron kang enough room for your stuff. Tapos, may divider dito, so you can put your wallet here. Tapos, may dala kang lipstick or makeup here naman. Tapos yung mechanism niya kung paano isasara, super dali. And the fact that these are jelly bags, so kahit matapunan sila ng tubig or maulanan sila, hindi mababa sa yung bag mo is freaking amazing. I love them so much that I wanna get every single color of this. I wanna thank my friend Erica Lee for recommending these bags because I've seen this sa uh, Insta story niya. And good thing na bumili ako kasi hindi ko malalaman na ganito pala kaganda. So I also recommend them to you guys. Hindi kayo magsisisi. Nasubukan ko na itong mga to. So alam ko na hindi ako mapapahiya. Trust me on this one. Super ganda nito talaga. And that is it you guys. We have finished everything. I've already shown you yung mga bags na nabili ko that are very trendy these days. I'll be linking everything sa description box para hindi na kayo mahirapan. If ever you guys decide to buy any of these bags, Please feel free to tag me on Instagram. I would love to see kung ano yung mga nabili nyo from my recommendations. If you guys have any idea of what items 
I should be checking out on Shopee next. And please comment it down below because I'm reading every comment as much as I could. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram at mycity underscore. Comment of the week is here. And I'll see you guys on the next one. May you all have clear skin and happy hearts. Bye! One, two, three, fuck it.